Hi, I'm JC Durst from SP Gymnastics. The JC team is uh, kind of home this week. Uh, yeah. Let's first talk about the road meet last week. San Jose State uh, high, team high score 193-225. Uh, why was the team so good? I think we've been doing a lot better with keeping our energy up and staying together as a team. And I think it's finally clicked on like how to um, keep everything together um, in a sense that we don't let any like small mishaps get in the way and we keep on supporting each other and we're having a lot more fun with our meets and I think that's definitely helped. Well, you definitely contributed on the floor like you usually do a 975. You're one of three Falcons to score yeah. on that. How did you feel about your routine? Um, I was really, really happy with my routine. Um, I think I did a lot better on my landings and I felt really confident and so I was really happy with that score. You've uh, been in the lineup now I think six straight weeks and been extremely consistent on the floor. What has been your key to that consistency? Um, well, floor is my favorite event, so I just kind of tell myself, you know, you have this, this is all you, and um, it just helps with my confidence. I feel like I'm pretty solid, um, just knowing that I have fun doing dance, and um, I don't know, just like that, like I said, with having fun and keeping it all together and staying focused. It's just, like I said, it's my favorite event, so. How has your adjustment to college gymnastics been? Um, it's definitely a lot different than high school and I guess growing up too, but it's super fun. I think the team aspect is huge and it makes everything a lot easier and um, there's a lot more support, I think, and it just, I don't know, it just, like I said, makes it fun and um, I just think it's super, super cool. Like, it's, it's pretty awesome. Certainly. Uh, there's been a lot of travel this year. You've had some extended road trips. Uh, how have you managed to deal with that travel? Um, it's, I think it's fun traveling. You know, you have to bring all your homework on the road and make sure you get all your assignments done and, you know, different environments make it a little different, like, makes the meet feel different, but all in all, it's super fun and I've liked it. Well, you still have the conference meet coming up, but the last regular season road meet is this week, but you want it to go far, just across town to yeah. the University of Washington to compete. Uh, how will that dynamic be, competing in Seattle, but at an unfamiliar arena for you? Yeah, I think it'll definitely still feel a little different just because it's not our gym, but having our team and knowing that we technically are still home, I think we'll um, still be successful with keeping our energy up and having fun with it, and I think it'll be a, a good meet. Well, let's talk a little bit about you. Uh, you're one of six freshmen on the yeah. team. How, how does the team, uh, that's one third of the entire roster, how have you six integrated into the, into the roster? Um, I think we all just bring something different to the team, which makes it super fun, and we all get along with everyone. And um, I don't know, it's just been a really great time. I think since we all have really different personalities, like we've all kind of found our own way, but we mix really well together, so that's been really good. Well, you're all six freshmen kind of scattered from uh, places oh, all around yeah. the country. Why don't you tell us where you're from? Um, I'm from Reno, Nevada. Um, it's northern Nevada. It's actually far from Las Vegas. People usually think that it's really close, but it's not. And uh, why did you decide to come to Seattle Pacific? Um, well, I've always wanted to live in Seattle for one. Um, so that was just already in my head. And then I just liked SPU because I liked the smaller campus and the community here seems really, really amazing. So I, my sights had been set on SPU for a while. You mentioned you've always wanted to live in Seattle. Why was that? What was the draw? Um, my parents grew up here and then I have family here as well. So we were always visiting when I was a kid. And so I just kind of fell in love with it at a young age. You mentioned your parents. Uh, they came up with a rather unique uh, first name, uh, JDC. How did they come <laughs> yeah. up with that? Um, so about a year before I was born, my uncle passed away, and his initials were JDC. And so my parents played with his initials and got JDC out of that. That's great. Yeah. What uh, You're just a freshman, so you have plenty of time to work on this, but uh, what do you plan to major in? Um, I'm planning on majoring in integrated studies, so for education, so like teaching elementary school and eventually um, high school, hopefully. Great. Fantastic. Well, JC, thanks so much for your time. Appreciate it, and good luck at the University of Washington on Thank Friday. Thank you. Thank you.